What's going on guys? Today I'm going to be comparing a brand new Phase 2 to an older Phase 2 that has well over 100 games on it. So, let's get started. What I'll be bowling on today is the 2018 state championships pattern. This is just a replica I made of what the oil looks like. Here is the actual lane graph. Before we look at the footage, I wanted to clarify that these two balls are not drilled the same. The layout on the old phase two is four and a quarter by five and a half by two and a half. And the layout on the new phase two is five by five by four. And for more clarification, I am a two-handed bowler throwing about 17 miles an hour in a 530 rev rate. Any shot I throw in this video, the bottom right hand corner will display whether or not that shot was with the new Phase 2 or the old Phase 2. Starting off with the old Phase 2, this has been my favorite ball for quite some time now and it's very versatile for me. I seem to be able to throw it on nearly any pattern and do just fine. However, recently I've noticed it's starting to die out. What I mean by that is it doesn't have as much hook on the back end like it used to, and it doesn't roll through the pins very hard. It deflects a lot more than it used to, and it leaves a lot of flat 10 pins. Though I love this ball, I've found myself using it less and less the past couple months. Occasionally, I find conditions that it still performs well on, but even then, I feel like I have another more viable option. I feel like I have to be more accurate with this ball to get the corner pins out and I still take good care of this ball. I use a rejuvenator to get oil out of the ball about twice a month. Though a decent amount of oil usually comes out, I don't see many performance changes on the lane. I don't adjust the surface on this ball hardly ever, so it has a lot of lane shine. I'm sure this ball will still get some use on certain house shots and burnt tournament conditions. Especially if I put some surface on it, this ball will still see the lanes quite a bit. With all of that being said, let's move on to the new Phase 2. I decided to get a new one because I liked my old one so much and I knew the day would come where it would die out. I've had this new one for a few months and it has less than 3 games on it. It's practically fresh out of the box. With the new Phase 2 on this pattern, there were a few lines I could play. One of them was about 18 to 4, 18 being at the arrows, 4 being at the breakpoint. While filming this video, the new Phase 2 really grew on me. When I first got it, I didn't like the motion it was giving me, so I never really threw it. Now that I'm learning to control the back end, and I see how hard it goes through the pins, I think this ball will get more use. Once I get some more games on this ball and it tames down a bit, I see myself liking it just as much as I liked my old one. You might have noticed earlier when I showed a picture, but this is a pin down ball, and this is the first ball I've ever had drilled pin down. I kind of wish I got it drilled the same way as my old one. I feel like the pin down makes it react just a little bit earlier than I like. But once I change the surface, that may change. That is all I have to say about the new and old phase two, but quickly I wanted to talk about high school bowling and junior gold. First off, I wanted to give an update on how my junior year of high school bowling went. This season, I averaged 206 for all 37 games I bowled, and for the 19 conference games I bowled, I had an average of 212. I also had the highest game in the conference this season at 280. I missed the state tournament by 5 pins, I shot 628 at districts, and the cut was 633. Overall, it was a good year, and I was happy with how I did. Finally, I wanted to talk about Junior Gold. This year, I'm in the U18 division, and I'm in Squad 4. I'm excited to finally go again since last year got cancelled due to COVID. I was looking forward to going to Vegas, but Indianapolis is a lot closer for me. I plan on doing some kind of YouTube content at Junior Gold, I haven't decided yet if I want to upload daily, like I did a few years ago, or if I'll make it a three-part series. But until then, I'm bowling in lots of leagues and trying to improve my game so I can do my best. But yeah guys, that is basically it for this video, and I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give it a thumbs up, and that's it, I'll see you guys in the next one.